Today, let us study about division of four and five digit numbers by a two digit number. Let us solve an example to understand division of four digit numbers by a two digit number. Divide 4358 by 12. To solve this simple division, there are five steps. Step 1 is to compare the digits. We compare the leftmost digit, that is, the thousands in the dividend, which is 4, with the divisor 12. As 4 is smaller than 12, we compare the hundreds in the dividend with the divisor. Here, 43 is greater than 12. Now, we can divide 43 by 12. So, step 2 is to divide. Here, as the divisor is 12, we use the table of 12 to find a product which is equal to or less than and nearest to 43. So, the nearest product is 36. Hence, we write 3 in the quotient above 3. Step 3 is to multiply 12 by 3. As we know, 12 into 3 is equal to 36. We write 36 under 43. Step 4 is to subtract 36 from 43, which is equal to 7. Now, step 5 is to bring down the next digit, that is 5. After bringing down the digit, we repeat steps 1 to 5 till there are no more digits to bring down. So, here we again compare 75 and 12. Here, 75 is greater than 12. So, we can divide 75 by 12. The nearest product to 75 in the table of 12 is 72. So, we write 6 in the quotient above the 5 and 72 under 75. Next, subtract 72 from 75, which is equal to 3. Now, bring down the next digit, that is 8. So, here we again compare 38 and 12. Here, 38 is greater than 12. So, we can divide 38 by 12. The nearest product in the table of 12 to 38 is 36. So, we write 3 in the quotient above the 8 and 36 under 38. Next, subtract 36 from 38, which is equal to 2. Now, as there are no more digits to bring down, we have finished our division. Thus, we get the quotient as 363 and remainder as 2. Now, let us solve division of 5-digit numbers by a 2-digit number. Divide 25,626 by 16. Compare the leftmost digit, that is, the ten thousands in the dividend, with the divisor. 2 is smaller than 16. So now compare the thousands in the dividend with the divisor. Yes, 25 is greater than 16. We can proceed to the second step. Here, as the divisor is 16, we use the table of 16 such that the product is equal to or less than and nearest to 25. So, the nearest product is 16. Hence, we write 1 in the quotient 
above 5 and 16 below 25. Now, subtract 16 from 25, which is equal to 9. Now, the next step is to bring down the next digit, that is 6. After bringing down the digit, we again compare 96 and 16. Here, 96 is greater than 16. So, we can divide 96 by 16. As we know, 16 into 6 is equal to 96. Write 6 in the quotient and subtract 96 from 96 to get 0. Now bring down the next digit, that is 2. Here 2 is smaller than 16. There are not enough tens to divide. So now write 0 in the quotient above 2. Therefore, subtract 0 from 2, which is equal to 2. Now bring down the next digit, that is 6. Now compare 26 and 16. Here, 26 is greater than 16. So, we can divide 26 by 16. The nearest product is 16. So, we write 1 in the quotient above the 6. Now, subtract 16 from 26, which is equal to 10. Here, the quotient is 1601 and the remainder is 10. Wasn't it fun learning division of 4 and 5 digit numbers by a 2 digit number?